Hello, Acapella Academy people. My name's Jerry Friedman. I'm from Los Angeles, California, um, home of the a lot of things. I'm either a tenor or a baritone, probably a low tenor, probably a high baritone. We'll find out. It'll be fun. I began playing piano when I was five. And during that same time, my teacher discovered that I had absolute pitch. Um, and pretty much from then on, my mom and I knew that, um, that music was in my future and it would forever be something that I would love and cherish and, and turn into a lifestyle. Wait, okay. Yeah. He's doing it in a different yeah, octave. Yeah, do it in where I play it. No. He wants to. Uh, you're playing it in an octave higher. Having absolute pitch has always helped me find harmonies and play piano and and play everything by ear. I mean, I still to this day barely know how to read music. Um, and I've been playing piano for 10 years now, <laughs> all off of, of ear pretty much, um, which is like half embarrassing, but I mean, it, it is what it is. Um, and it's helped me tremendously. It's the top of you to be with the ones you love. I've been a fan and a participant of acapella groups since I've been 10. I'm 15 now. Um, and I think the most amazing part about acapella um, is the fact that there, there is no instruments. Um, the ability for a group of people to come together, um, try and sound like one voice, one big voice with a bunch of harmonies and, and just beautiful sounds, um, come together, make all different instrumental sounds and, and really be a part of something greater than yourself. Um, is the most amazing thing about acapella for me. For my first song, I'm singing Jealous by Labyrinth. I'm jealous of the rain That falls upon your skin It's closer than my hands have been Oh, I'm jealous of the rain I'm jealous of the wind that ripples through your clothes. It's closer than my shadow. Oh, I'm jealous of the wind. Cause I wish you. The best of all this world could give And I told you when you left me There's nothing to forgive But I always thought you'd come back Tell me all you found was Heartbreak and misery It's hard for me to say I'm jealous of the way You're happy without me oh. For my second song, I'm singing Someone You Loved by Louis Capaldi I'm going under and this time I fear there's no one to save me This all or nothing really got a way of driving me crazy But I need somebody to heal Somebody to know Somebody to have Somebody to hold It's easy to say But it's never the same I guess I kinda like the way you help me escape For now the day bleeds into nightfall and you're not here to get me through it all i let my guard down and then you pulled the rug i was getting kind of used to being someone you loved here's george on my mind tenor part <laughs>
Here's I wish baritone part and then tenor part. Days could come back, oh, days and why did they have to go? Days could come back, oh, days and ooh, I love them so. Do 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 Days could come back, oh, days and why did they have to go? Days could come back, oh, days and ooh, I love them so. academy because i really want to better my craft um and hopefully turn music into something that could be a career for me and and surround myself with with people who feel the same way and who really want to strive toward bettering themselves as musicians and as humans and um and just in, be able to enjoy music together with with people who are dedicated and and really just have a love for it I was able to have the opportunity to work with Lindsay Ryan and Rock and Acapella and perform in all different kinds of places. I was 
truly able to get a taste of what Acapella Academy is like through that experience. And I'm so, so grateful to it. The friends that I made and, and the connections that I was able to create were life-changing. Um, we still talk today, and and it's just crazy to, to see everyone grow up. Um, I mean, especially myself. I'm, you know, I was I was really young um, at the time, and I think now with with more knowledge and, and age, um, time passed and everything. I I'm ready to experience that again. <laughs> I just remember before some performances, we'd be uh, nervous wrecks and and after every performance, we were, we were just so grateful that we, we had gotten through it together. And and um, after every performance, I always remember we had this Instagram chat and everyone would go on it and just tell each other how great they were and, and send hearts and just tell each other that we loved each other. And, and it was special, you know? It was truly special. It really was. After about a year and a half or two years of me being in the group, um, Lindsay moved to Minnesota to pursue her own career, right, rightfully so. She's tremendously talented. And, and so the group sort of fell apart after that. And, and it was sad to see. Um, and, and I have been trying to sort of rekindle that experience with, with other acapella opportunities here and there, and it totally hasn't been the same. <laughs> um, the amount of dedication and, and love for music and love for each other that these kids had was like special, like truly special. And I've heard from Lindsay over and over, hey, it all stems from, from Acapella Academy. And so here I am auditioning for <laughs> Acapella Academy and to be able to experience that once more at this age now um, would be, words can't describe how awesome that would be. There's still so much music arrangement work that I wanna learn. For the past three years, I've really been honing in on my songwriting skills and my music production skills and really trying to get that um, to where I want it to be. Um, and I've loved, I loved every minute of it. It's, it's been great. And I think that, that arrangement, an acapella arrangement, is such a great tool and it translates right over to songwriting and production in terms of learning where, you know, where certain parts go in production or, or where a verse goes or a, a chorus should come in or or things like that, um, harmonies, just everything about acapella translates right over to music production and songwriting. And I think that Acapella Academy could give me a great opportunity to use some of those skills within my songwriting and music production. What would I bring to Acapella Academy? Positivity, dedication, um, openness, love. I wanna be the type of person that when everyone goes to lunch, I'm still singing. Like, I'm still singing, other people are still singing, we're still harmonizing, it's a great time. Um, and we just don't stop singing and music just keeps, <laughs> keeps going on and keeps going on. With all that said, Thanks for your consideration and thanks for watching 15 minutes of this video. Um, appreciate you. Thank you.